What's up guys? Just thought it was about time for me to come back to YouTube and to just make a little video explain where I've been and uh, just giving you guys a little bit of uh, what my life's looked like for the last few months. So pretty much last of the video I recorded was in Shushwap with the boys with Ragai, Danny and Matt and Jay Paul. That was yeah, that's three months ago now and uh, I think since then school started and I went back to Shushwap a few weeks later but I didn't I recorded it but the video didn't really turn out that well and so I didn't really upload it and so now that you know now that it's been so long since I uploaded I thought that it was about time that I just you know did a quick little video explaining what I've been doing what I've been up to and uh I think that it's important for me to start with the fact that right now we're going into wave two of COVID. Wave one came, you know, everyone knows, you know, you know, eight months ago. And uh, I think that now that wave two's come in, I think that we all have, we've all kind of grown from this situation. I feel like everyone on the planet has grown from this situation. We've all, in a way, became more independent of ourselves and of our families. We've all... We've all, in a way, I feel like, in for me, I've grown way closer with my family than I was before. I was, before I'd spend a lot more time with my friends. Now I'm spending every day with my family and I've built new relationships with my coworkers and I've been spending a lot more time either at work, by myself, focusing on school or with my family. And I don't think that's actually a bad thing. I think that this is a time for all of us to, in a way, grow up and and you know learn you know learn a different almost a different way of life you know like not all bad out of this situation right like you got to think of the good things and i think that's one thing i've i feel like i've taken the best of this bad situation i've i've read a lot of books spent a lot of time with my family and most importantly i feel like like i've became more independent as a person I know that I get a lot of flack from some of my friends that I don't see them very often. I don't hang out with them, but at the same time, like this year has been a time for myself to build my own perspectives and my own views on this world. And I find that, that that's an important, that's an important part of life. It's important to grow up and to, to find the, to find your own personal view of things. Right. I feel like that's one thing I've been doing. Like, I haven't seen any of my friends for a few months. It's probably been like a month and a half, two months. And I think that like I think that now is the time for people my age to to build their own perspectives on this world. And I feel like that's one thing I've taken complete advantage of and I feel like I'm way way more red than I was before. I feel like I've found ways to cope with anxiety a lot better and I feel like like I I quit smoking weed. I don't drink alcohol that much anymore and I feel like that's one thing that that I, that I feel like I've grown out of is that phase in my life where I feel like I kind of needed that to like you know keep me occupied nowadays it's a lot more like okay well if I'm bored I'm gonna go read a book maybe I'll focus on school I'll write I'll write something I've been doing a lot of writing lately and uh, I think that this has honestly been a good opportunity for myself to learn about me and to to progress, right? I feel like that's one thing we should all be doing. We should all be taking this opportunity to progress and to, to learn certain things about life we didn't know before. I've been spending a lot of time learning about different political ideologies, especially because I'm in political science and public relations. I feel like that's one thing I've been spending a lot of time is focusing on certain aspects of life I didn't know. I've been focusing on a different, or focusing on a lot of different other religions and people in different cultures. And I've had the opportunity to actually expand my knowledge on things I never even knew existed. Like I've been, I read a lot about Buddhism and Hinduism and uh, like Taoism and Confucianism. And these are all different things I actually had no clue. I didn't, I mean, I knew that they were a thing, but I had no clue on the depth of them and how how complex these the way of thinking was and I've come to appreciate a lot more things being more being more read and it makes me want to go and explore and to to get out of 
uh, a comfort get out of my comfort zone that I that I I I feel like in a way before I feel like I was I just felt too uncomfortable to go do those things and now I feel like I want to go and I want to go travel and I want to go see all these places I want to go see what different cultures are like and I want to I want to experience the things I've been reading and I find like that's one thing I feel like I'm going to take complete advantage of once COVID's done is I feel like I'm so much more read I feel like I want to go and I feel like now that I know have knowledge on the way people live in different countries I feel like I have the knowledge to go and experience it and I feel like that's one thing that's important that I've learned as well as uh, I've been doing a lot of reading on like uh, as I said different political ideologies and the way that politics politics works on the on like a world scale and how 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 much politics actually influences our everyday lives and I feel like that's one thing that's super important especially we see down in the states because I'm here I'm up here in BC I feel like I've learned a lot about the American uh, democratic system the Canadian democratic system and I feel like like just those just understanding those things and and the way that voting works and the way that like I have a newfound I guess I have a newfound love for and respect for for the way political system systems work and I feel like like these are these are important things these help build build your 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 uh your opinion on on the world right and i feel like that's one thing i've been able to take complete advantage of so although covid has you know been shitty and i haven't been able to see my friends i haven't been able to go drinking and partying and doing all this other stuff and maybe i've been negating my friends and i haven't really been able to hang out with them but at the same time i've also learned so much within this last year just you know sitting here in my bedroom you know that's all I've been doing, sitting here, reading, learning. And I feel like like this year, honestly, I feel like although it's been shitty for a lot of people, for me, it's actually not been bad. And I feel like that's that's something to me that's super important. I know that for other people and my 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 love and, and my hope goes out to everyone else that may be struggling during this time. I just feel like this is a time for people who can educate yourself learn and read and and be properly informed because i know that when covid's done and i can go and i can go experience the world i know that i will be way more prepared than i was prior and so although it's been bad there's a lot of positives in this and i just wanted to say uh i just wanted to say you know i'm sorry for not uploading on youtube I know I don't owe anything to anybody, but at the same time, I feel like, like, I honestly feel like I owe it to myself to begin uploading again, and I feel like I owe it to myself to, to continue YouTube, and to help build my organization, and as I say, I've been writing a lot, I've been writing my book, spending a lot of time on that, I don't know when it'll be done, I've been, I spent like, now it's almost been three years since I started it, so... I don't know how long it's gonna take. It'll take, I guess it takes as long as it takes, but I need to find a, a publisher, an editor, and uh, I don't know. Shit is just going amazing for me right now, and I freaking love it. And and I feel like although I, I don't wanna you know tarnish my friendships, but although I've been spending a lot of time away from them, I feel like it's a good time for me to build my own perspective without my own opinions being being influenced by other people right and i find like that's something that's super important so i just feel like you know i just wanted to come on here and explain to you guys what i've been doing and what life's like and the things i've learned and uh i just want to say you know thanks for watching and uh i'll be uploading a lot during december because there's so many more things i want to go do i have a lot of different video ideas and since snow is starting to snow here uh, i want to go snowboarding i'll be be recording a bunch of that stuff too so it'll actually be great it's gonna be a great winter i'm honestly really excited for winter it's my favorite time of year i love summer but winter is better like come on let's be honest winter is 100 percent better anyways <laughs> I'll, uh, I'll see you guys later thank you for watching and uh i'll see you later